just go before the camera turned on. Yeah, yes, we did. I'm asking my boyfriend, Juicy Guy, questions that girls are what afraid to ask. What kind of questions are you going to be? Questions that girls are, are afraid to ask you guys, but they just know they juicy. Like, and I, just I need an example. Like, what kind of questions? You'll see when this video starts. Oh, but oh. anyways, you guys, oh. make sure you, you like, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, channel you guys. guys. And also, subscribe to our channel right now and screenshot that you subscribe to us. And also tag us any on Instagram for an Instagram shout out. And on that note, you guys. Like she said, go ahead and screenshot that you subscribe to our channel. That way we can take the screenshot, tag us in it. That way we can shout you back out and possibly give you a shout out in our next video. video. And also, you guys, make sure you follow us on all social media. It's all down inside the description. Make sure you follow everything. Snapchat, Facebook, Instagram. TikTok. TikTok. Follow all our that. business Facebook page at ENT Nation. And on that note, you guys, we're about to go ahead and get right Oh, oh we forgot. We got to set our goal. Let's get this video to how many? Team E, I'll get 5,000. T10, we get these videos to 10,000. 10,000 likes. Look, Team E, I'll get the 5,000. Team 10, we're gonna get this video to 10,000. So make sure you share this video with your uncle, brother, sister, cousin, auntie, auntie, elder guy, cousin, on mama side, sister, auntie, brother, I'm sister. I'm not a cousin, but imaginary. I get what you're saying. No, I'm talking about the real one. Other side, like, like, auntie, cousin, your other cousin, dad, sister, mama. I don't even know what you're talking about, but. I'm scared. I'm in the hot seat. I'm in the hot seat. Are you I'm scared, scared for real? I'm scared. By the way, y'all, let me check out my hair. I'm gonna make sure it look good. I gotta make sure I look good for the video. What? It's too late for it. The camera already. Right oh, okay, okay, okay. But it, right now. it's okay. But let me so go. If you already ahead. looking ugly, they already seen you looking ugly. So whatever. But I, I was looking ugly, boo boo. Don't, don't need you to do that. Don't need you to do that. Uh, but okay. anyways, we we're going we right here with the first question. Question one. Question, question one. one. I'm gonna start off slight. Start so off slight. slight. Okay. Why is it so hard for guys to open up? So hard. Okay. Why is it hard for guys to open up? All right. There's some slight. There's right a here. lot of answers to that question. Why are guys are hard to open up? One, guys are hard to open up because the girl will try to go back and throw it in your face when y'all get in an argument or something happens and go down. When it get real, they try to throw it in your face. Mm. Two, they take advantage of you. Got no type of females that take advantage of what they know is wrong with you, so they're gonna use it for your, your kindness, for your weakness. Mm -hmm. And three, another reason why I would be you. What was the question? One more time? Why is it so hard for guys to open up? Oh, uh, shoot. No, three is hard for guys to open up because they seem more like a female thing. So I feel like they be scared to get their feelings involved. What you mean, scared to get their feelings involved? It's a, it seems like a female, that's a more of a female type of thing, y'all. Like, think about it. What a guy open up his feelings. It's more of a I mean, if you love her, you're gonna open up to her. <laughs> you say you ain't gonna marry You ain't gonna open up to the woman that you're gonna marry? You, you open are, up. But you, you open up already, so cut it. Cut the Come on now, hold on now, hold on now. Cut the cheek. Next question, next question, next question. All right, question number two, you guys. Question number two. Okay. Why don't guys say I love you first? <sighs> Why they don't say I love you first? I don't even think you told me you love me first. You're not answering. Because, like I said, uh, <laughs> one thing. One thing is because it make guys seem very feminine if they Fem say. Feminine. Feminine? feminine? You trying to correct me? I said it like, right, but y'all not coming to me. Say, feel feminine for saying it for the first because, time. Because, I mean, like, a guy saying, I love you. I mean, you, you love me? Yeah. Say, tell me you love so me. So you trying to make me look like, like, well, no, I'm I'm saying, I'm like, I just said, I just said, why is it so hard for you to just say, I love you, friend? If you love the girl, just love them. Just tell them. Because, she like, you be shy. Just like female be shy. A guy be shy around females. So it's like. Okay. It's, that's, like how you, that's how you know what a guy really into you now. When he be shy and he be scared to say stuff, he be afraid of how you gonna react and stuff. Uh, that's how you know what a guy into you. Uh, I'm telling you, that's how you know. I like that. You just gave me the pointers. Yeah. What you mean pointers for? This no, the end. No. Ain't no more. Ain't no more. No, 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 no. no, 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 no. I see that. Oh, uh, uh. No, no. Uh, you said corners like you, like you. No, know. you was very, for the next you was one very shy around me and stuff. So now I know you was really digging me. You was really feeling me once. Yeah, you feel a little here. I'm feeling you too, honey. I'm feeling you too. All right, third question. Question number three. Mm. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm gonna step it up a notch. Okay, let's see. Why don't guys moan door six? That's more female. Most dell female. So what do guys do? What? Just be quiet? Quiet. You know what I'm saying? They just, oh, they just be quiet. They be like. They be whispering. Hmm. They be whispering. See, like, I, can't, I, can't I can't say all that, okay? I, I, I feel I like this is not fun, but it's not fun to play for me. But I say, I don't know what, what, ooh, what do I do? I ain't gonna tell you what you do. <laughs> we ain't gonna go there, brother. <laughs> you sure you want me to tell them? You want me? To, you 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 be doing it. No, I don't. <laughs> what you trying to say? I be doing it. I be doing it. <laughs> Oh, so you do that for real? No, no, you always no, no, let them know no, no, that you do that for real. Now we just trying to question number four. What are guys' biggest turnoffs? What are their biggest turnoffs? Guys' biggest turn. What you mean, for female? Like biggest turnoff. Period. All right. One, one of my biggest turnoffs is my biggest biggest P turnoff for females when she ratchet and she doing all that in public and like. Babe, I was ratchet the other day. And like, and, and, and like, and like, she don't keep, she don't keep our business to us. Like, you know what I'm saying, like, she don't keep what we got going on with us. It's like she always letting the public you know. And then, like, basically, like a female that don't keep us is us. Like, keep our bond with special to us private. You know what I'm saying? Because that's why, that's why it's so special because it's private. Am I right or wrong? Guys, y'all don't want no females that just every time something happens, we go tell them that. Blah 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 blah. Go tell them that. Go tell them that. Every time y'all argue, blah 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 blah. She go tell them that. Burn that. Burn. Why? We'll be right back again. Why? Why? You're right. Why? 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 And like, uh, what it is? Second turn off uh, for a female is a female that's not fun. Like, she ain't got no sense of humor. She don't like to laugh. She always too serious. Like, mm. like, like, mm. like, she don't, she don't want to, like, get loose. Have fun. Get you know what I'm saying? Hey, you little one. And then, what, what's the third turn off for me? Oh, she ain't got that wet shit. Oh! Shave or not? No, why not? <laughs> I mean, it all just depends. I mean, I know in the winter time, you know, I know females like to, you know, keep it, you know, keep it a little warm. This one said, I know it's cold, but like to keep it a little warm. when it's time to, you know, the woo get the scoop, the scoop, you know, yeah, you gotta be shaved. <laughs> it gotta be shaved. Gotta, gotta be shaved. Got so if it's not shaved, what you gonna do? Go, go up to the stove. <laughs> you gonna buy that shaving cream? Buy that shaving cream, we we'll have to get it done. You gonna do it for? See, that's not the question. <laughs> see, now you, you take the question more than what it is. Okay. See, see, stick to the question. Okay, okay, I'm gonna stick, yeah. to, stick to the question. Next question. Why do guys always want to experience going to the script club? You'll tell some crazy. What, 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 why? Just today, today. I was talking about going to the strip club. Why do you want to go to the strip club? Just today, I was talking about going to the strip club. Why? Because, what is the hype? Because look, all right, look, all right, check this out, check this out. This is how I look at. This is how I look at. It. Now I want to hear it. Now I'm just, I want to hear it in a conversation. Look, all right. Hold on, I gotta make sure I word it right. Cause you know how you two. We listen. Oh, okay, okay. So I say it's bad. It's it's just it's different when you go into a strip club and you just going out. You know what I'm saying? Like random. You know what I'm saying? Like a random. I said, why do guys want to experience going to the strip club? Because it's fun. Who don't want to? I don't want to experience going to the strip club. What's the question? You keep forgetting these questions. Why, why do guys? guys? Exactly. Because who don't? What? Well, you wouldn't be have a girlfriend. She, she a stripper. See, look, some, see, look, guys like me, they don't want their girlfriend to be in that type of stuff. They don't want their girlfriend to be no stripper. This and that, nigga. That's not how she care. I said that's not her type. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's not what she do. So it's like we leave that, we leave that, we leave that right there to the strippers. That's that's what that is. We leaving that to the strippers, and we just gonna go to watch, and then that's it. We gonna now y'all be trying to touch on the booty, throw the money. 
It ain't nothing like that. It's just a feeling experience. It's just the exercise I hand, you know? So you mean to tell me you go go to the strip club? No, I'm not saying I'm going to go to the strip club. Exactly why he not going to the strip club. No. Don't get mad now because you just told me what you was going to do. Exercise I'm speaking for guys. I'm not speaking for me. Oh, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Next question. Question number... I don't even know. Six. It's question number six. Five, didn't we? I'm not sure. Yeah. It's question number five or six. I don't know. What? Count on your name. What do you want to do? I don't know. But I'm just going to ask this question. Do guys look at girls differently when they do it on the first night? Uh, me personally as a guy, I don't... Well, guys, I know some guys are looking at me like doing it on the first night as a, a more like a, a, a easy to get type of move. You know, guys, some guys like females that play hard to get, and you know, they be some of us. That, six out of ten, that be a female that, you know, is something. You know what I'm saying? Faithful is something. She play hard to get because, you know, she watching herself. But it is females out there. Like I said, I look at my, for me as far as myself, I don't look at it like that. You know what I'm saying? She look at it like it just, she it just, up on the first night, she just give it up. I mean, some females love D, you know what I'm saying? Some females just like that, you know what I'm saying? It don't all because you get on front, I mean, she just not nothing, you know what I'm mean? saying? You never know, it might be different for you. Maybe she gave you on the first night, but she didn't give everybody else on the first night. Everybody else waited a month, but just because she liked your vibe, like who you was, so she gave you on the first night. You see what I'm saying? You gotta look at it both ways up. Has somebody else gave it to you on the first night? That's not the question, so I can't even answer that. But yes, they uh, are. All right, on to the next. Yes, Let's go. Yeah. On to the next. Hey, it's quite fine. Hey, it's quite fine. You're telling me some secrets. Who gave it to you on the first night? Nick Wadon. Nick Wadon. Nick Wadon. Uh -huh. Who gave it to you on the first night? Next question. Tell me. I want to know your stories. Next question. This is on. No, he was careful. Ain't nothing to do with No, he was careful. Oh. Big talk, huh? <laughs> Next question, you guys. Okay. You. Oh, well, well, uh, I, you already know. I already know how you at. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what I already know? What you had going? You already know. Play stupid for that camera. I don't already know who did something to you on the first night. Who did? Yeah. You never told me the story. Nobody. I don't know Nobody. the story. Like I said, like I, I, said, I never told you the story, but you knew. No, I didn't. Know about nobody who gave it to you on the first night. I feel like you just lying for the camera. Ooh. He capped for the camera, you guys. But, anyways, next question. But, next question I know we have. I saw the first week. Who did it on the first <laughs> week? Who did it on the first week? You never told me these stories. Who did it on the first week? No. <laughs> I think we need to go to the next question. Okay, we go to the next question. We're going to get back to this. Uh, but anyways, you guys, next question. Do guys smell us when we on our periods? So do guys smell girls when they on their periods? Sometimes. Why do you smell them? Like, why wait, do you wait, you said do we smell all like naturally or do we actually No, like actually smell? try to smell. Nah, why? Me as a guy, I don't try to smell female, but I think sometimes you can just smell it already, but me as a person, I don't smell it. <laughs> well, I don't, I don't know guys that just go and try to smell female. It's weird. It's weird. really weird. That's yeah, weird to me, because I, I ain't never seen nothing like that. But alright. Remember I showed you my thing before, and uh -huh. you were so disgusted. Yeah, like I said, though. Uh, next question. Next question. That's nasty. You don't want to smell it. That's nasty. Okay. Alright, you guys. Next question. You ready for this next juicy question? I've been ready for all the questions. Okay. Ain't no question I'm not ready for, so. Next question, you guys. Mm -hmm. What makes guys scared to commit to one female? Ooh. One female. Not two, not three. One. It's a lot to that question. Why are guys scared to commit to one female? I got about five, 10, 15, 20 reasons. All right, one. Why I got scared to commit to a female is because, like you said, you got guy, a female that's playing with your heart. Just like, you know, guys who play with a female heart. Two reasons why guys scared to commit to a female, trust, you know. Trust. Then this generation, a lot of people has trust issues and trust is really messed up. So it's like, but y'all right now, if you go across somebody that's trusting you and willing to go through problems and help you fix your problems, might want to keep them because there's not too many out there. Like keep them. Might want to keep them. But number three, I be forgetting the question why. I, be <laughs> I, I say guys why I'm scared to commit to okay. one female. And three, I say why guys scared to commit to one female is they're going to miss that single life. 
Some dudes, some dudes gonna miss that single life. Some dudes miss the singing light. I'm telling you, some dudes miss the singing light, so it's like, some dudes, hear that. They, they, they used to moving on their own, you know what I'm saying? Going house to house, female to female, you know what I'm saying? In and out. But they can't do that no more. They can't do that no more at the end of that. Because if you do that, it's in the old relationship. In of it. The end. All right, we're gonna move on to the next. Next question. The next question is, how does it feel when you go out with your girl and guys are looking at her? <laughs> How does it make you feel? What? What you, what you doing? I hope you bomb your fist up like that. <laughs> but it make you feel mad, bro. Cause like, why are you looking at me? But at the same time, I don't feel like that because I already know this. Oh, um, I ain't got to worry about none of that. Look, <laughs> and I, I ain't got nothing to worry. I mean, you can look, but as long as you don't touch, as long as you keep your hands to you, as long as you keep your hands to yourself, you straight, but you get to touch it, I'm going to touch you. You know what I'm saying? Oh, oh. that one right there. Oh, oh. I like that line. I like I guess it depends on the mood, but off the top, guys don't like that. You know what I'm saying? We don't like that. It just it's all about what guys are insecure, like they female, who what guys are overprotective. Or not it's not even being overprotective. Who's don't just don't like that. So it's just all about the type. True. So next question. Would you take a girl back? If she cheated, if she cheated. It depends on what happened, why she cheated. What you mean? It depends on why like she cheated. Like if the cheated, guy like, did something. Yeah. Okay. If it's but just what if like, she just cheated off the roof? What you mean? Like, like cheating, you ain't never did nothing. Somebody cheating, you ain't never did nothing, huh? Yeah. Uh, like I said, second chance for sure. I'm gonna get another chance. I'm gonna get another, you know, 15 day free trial. 15 day free trial? Is that enough time to rebuild? We're gonna get, we're gonna get another month free trial. How you gonna and trust then, her? And we'll get another one free trial, and after that, um, we're gonna see how things go. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna wow. work on it. But we ain't gonna give up, though. That's how I have to give up. Like, Auntie Nate, we don't give up. Do we? Do we? Do, do we give up? Do well, we, we never. We, yeah, we, we, we yes, not gonna go through that situation. Mm -hmm. we, we not gonna go through that situation, so we ain't gotta worry. Yeah, I'm, just, I'm, I'm saying, like, Auntie Nate, I'm saying, they don't give up. They still support. Oh, yeah, they yeah. watch us. They share with their uncle, brother, sister, cousin, auntie, nephew, and God. Auntie, nephew, yeah. Yeah, auntie, yeah. Yeah, they do all. They damn right. Team Ted, Team E, Ted, that dude right there sitting beside you. Get up, Subscribe say it with me. Team Ted, Team, team, team Ted, Ted, tell him in the background too. Say it, you, yeah, you, you, say it. Say Team E. I said team. I heard you back there. No, I did not say say Team E. I said say Team Ted. Whatever. Next question. Next question. What is the best and worst thing about being a male? Oh, <laughs> that was a good one. That's it. Good one. Uh, what's the best thing, worst thing? Best thing about being a male, I say one, we giving the pleasure. Mm -hmm. Shit, one said mm -hmm. we giving the pleasure. You know what I'm saying? We feeling this. One thing about good to be a male. Two, we can be look good, strong, healthy, and we ain't really got to worry about all that because if females, you know what I'm saying, y'all can't really, you know, must it's a trip. <laughs> you know what I'm Females can't really do all that, you know. Females got to keep their legs closed. Guys got to keep their legs closed. I got muscles. <laughs> I got muscle. Y'all see that? Oh, hurry, I'm ready. strong. I can't feel my muscle, so you got a day. Uh, but uh, I say what's the two, the third, a third good thing about being a guy. But what I did say, you know, we ain't gotta worry about you know, in between our legs. You know what I'm saying? But you do gotta worry thing, about what's in between oh, your legs. Oh, third though. thing, we ain't got no period. Oh yeah. Oh, I can't do that. Y'all lucky. Uh, I can't do that. What's the worst thing about Even though some guys do be on their period, so don't get me wrong, but. What's the worst thing about being a male? Uh, worst thing about being a male is, males are always stereotyped with bad intentions. What that mean? As in like, when the things come down and stuff. All right, let's say with certain things, y'all, when you look at a male and look at female, let's say like, let's say like, I do vandalize somebody's car to start, you know what I'm saying, take a weapon and start hitting their car, and the two people was a male or female. Nine times out of 10, they gonna look at what? The male. The male, that's what I'm saying. Oh, okay. Males are stereotyped. Where most like things with some bad or some bad intentions, the male's gonna get stereotyped. They're gonna get looked at first before the female. Okay. And it's like, oh, uh, what's another bad thing about being a male? You gotta name so many. Just, oh, you know. males, males have bad um hygiene. I'm just playing. He don't have bad hygiene, but some uh, males no. do have bad hygiene. Uh, some males do. That can be two. And three, I say males have a lot, a lot, a lot of, um, what it is? Influences? What's it called? Huh? Bad influences? Yeah, like we have a lot of bad influences, you know what I'm saying, like in the male community. Like being around like you been like boys, y'all know you've been around a whole bunch of boys and been all your partners. It'd be a lot of things that come across our plate in the whole day that's mm -hmm. 
A lot of them are bad intentions, are bad habits, but it's just all about how boys work. All right. My next question. What makes a girl sexually attractive? Strip club. Boy, <laughs> that's exactly why you're not going. I don't know what you're doing that for, because I ain't got that. I got a little pancake. You want to see? You got a little pancake. <laughs> All right, what is said, it? What makes a girl sexually attractive? Uh, uh, like I said, but a boy. I mean, like I'm not. You like chocolate booty? You like I ain't that saying that. Booty. I ain't saying that necessarily because it's like it's different for me because it's like I don't really, I don't, I don't, I don't look at female like that. You know what so saying? what makes you sexually like, attractive just, to me? Your person, you though. Me. Just, uh, uh, what makes you be like, mm, I want to eat you? Okay, you're taking this question a little bit too far. Where do you, 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 you get that from? Uh, no, I'm just saying, like, what makes you be like, mm, I just want to kiss you? What uh, makes you do that? What makes you, like, do that? How you are? Uh, how you at? Uh, how you are? How you at? Uh, but, I, but speaking for all guys, this for most guys, that's why I see it. This more guys is what, you know, up here. Shape. That's most guys though. It's just but it's, you got me and I don't have all of those features. You do you got some features on the other see other just don't know. So. I don't think I have all those features that a typical yeah. guy would expect in a girl, but I'm a cute. I got a face card. That's all I need. What? She be hating on herself, but it's alright. It's alright. It's alright. Right. We go to the next question. Next, next question. Next question. Next question. Do guys like makeup or no makeup? What do y'all like more? Makeup or no? Uh, I say guys, we, me, I no makeup. Me, no makeup. Some, it depends on the guy. Most classy, you know, who you guys do like makeup and some regular guys just like it natural. You know what I'm saying? Like, but me, I just like it natural. I like a female that could just, she ain't gotta have all these extra features. But she do. Put, Cause I gotta think about but, it. But she do put that feature on you and still like it. Yeah, I'm saying I'ma like it, but it's like when you put on makeup, like for me, it's like when a female put on makeup every day. Like let's say I, I want to surprise her on a date, or I want to surprise her, take out, take her somewhere. I be like, all right, get a little fan dress up. She put on makeup, but she puts on makeup every single day. I mean, the only thing she can do is like switch up the color. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Like I like makeup to be a special type of thing. Like once in a while. Yeah, special like like I like a special occasion type of thing, not an everyday thing. That's how I look at that. Okay. But don't get me wrong, it's not wrong with females that wear makeup every day. It's nothing wrong with that. It's it just me cute. as a guy. It be cute, cause I be liking it, but, but also, I don't gotta do it. Nah, this be straight too when females on um, do just like eyebrows. Cause oh, yeah. I, I, nah, that's fine. I like that. I like that. Just he like the eyebrow thingy. I like the eyebrow. I can't get but it. But all that face, the whole face cover, oh, nah. 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 Nah, nah. But it be cute to me, so. Nah. Next question. Man. Guys, this is the last question for today. And the question that I have is, how can you tell when a guy is simply unattractive? I mean, uninterested, my bad, uninterested. Last question, how can you tell when a guy is simply uninterested? One, attention, two. What you mean by attention? Like if they showing lack of attention to you? No, I won't say that. Because what? some guys, like me, myself, I know sometimes y'all don't see me always when I help them. Too late now, the video over. I told you we were already ugly throughout the whole video. Oh my god! <laughs> like, me as a person, um, I know sometimes, like, me and Elton, uh, whatever it is, I'm not always attention with Elton. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't say that. I wouldn't say that attention wise. I say one, uh, alright, boom. When y'all get into an argument, he not putting no effort into towards solving it. He doesn't, like, he's making it seem like he just don't care. So I'm smiling so, like, when you first meet a guy. How do you, how can you tell when they're uninterested in you? Oh. That's what I'm saying. Uh, I'm not talking about relationship. He, one, he's not trying to learn about you. He's not trying to, you know what I'm saying? He's not trying to learn about you. Two. I think he takes dry or something. Yeah, he takes and dry. He talking dry. He not trying to hold a conversation long. And he not, like I said, cause and then the third one, I was gonna say he not trying to, you know what I'm saying, help you experience more things because, but that go with number one, because if he not trying to learn about you, how he gonna know what you done experienced? That way he can open it up, so. Y'all heard it from here, Lil Tid. That's all that is, man. You heard from Lil Tid, you know why Lil Tid, Lil Tid know why lie. I he lie. does. But, anyways, you guys. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, you guys. That will be the end of this video, you guys. And
and I hope some of the questions that I answer will be able to help you guys and out. females comment, out. Comment down below which question that you really like that he answered the best. Comment down below that. And also, you guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Subscribe. A lot of y'all are been forgetting to subscribe. Y'all watching our channel, but subscribe that button. Hit that subscribe button. Hit it. Hit it. Turn it gray. Turn that bell. Ding 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 Turn that bell on too so you'll be notified when our next video drops. drops. And also you guys make sure you follow us on all social medias like oh, we always say. On that note. We're about to end this video off with, with the E. And T.